What's up, guys? Uh, welcome back to Vaughn's Voice. Uh, it's the Wednesday episode. It's 7.40 a.m. Uh, May 10th. And we're just... We're gaming. We're out here. We're doing the episode. Uh, I was up. I was out just doing stuff. So I thought I'd record before I uh, <coughs> go to bed. Uh I work at three, so it's not like a big deal to go to bed so late, honestly. Because if I go to bed at like 8.30, okay, it's a terrible thing, but whatever. It's not a big deal. It won't be a big deal. I've done it before. I've been doing it since high school. But, yeah, nothing big happened the last two days. Uh, just work. Uh, nothing like personal happening, nothing big, so we're just chilling. Uh, what I want to talk about today is the major is going on. CSGO major, like I said. Uh, this is what we're going to be talking about a bit. Um, so, there's already been two teams eliminated, which are Fluxo and Mouse Sports, which I picked... Fluxo to go 3 which they did, but um, I p- I picked Mao Sports to go 3-0, and, um, or Mao, and they went 0-3. They got dumped, and it's a surprising thing because they're ranked, what in the world, they were 11th in the world rankings, and they got second at the last major, but I was listening, and it um, the commentators were like, it just shows that like their style had been found out and stuff, and they haven't changed much, and they just depend on uh, like Frozen to carry and shit like that. So, I was talking to Seth yesterday morning about it and stuff because we were watching, but we were watching Liquid in the afternoon. But yeah, um, so yeah, those are the two teams that are eliminated. The two teams that qualified for Legend stage already are uh. Ensign G2, which um, G2's isn't, G2 isn't surprising. I picked them to go through. And Ents, I wouldn't say it's surprising. I just didn't think they would 3 0 because I didn't think they were. And they played FaZe uh, for their 3 0 match. And they beat FaZe in a best of three, which FaZe is a ranked fifth in the world and Ents is ninth. So it's not like, you know. Yeah. But uh, rankings don't really matter because Liquid's 7, and they're 1-2 right now. And uh, they play at 9.30 or 8.30 or something Like when I'm laying down. Uh, I'm watching OG and Gamer Legion play right now. And uh, who's back there? Monty and Mongol, Mongols. They're, both, they're all 1-2. So whoever loses these, they're out the major too. And then uh, there's two one matches later in the day as well. So, uh, and then tomorrow's like the final day to see who made it and who didn't. But um, Liquid's down one and two. They beat Fluxo yesterday, not very convincingly either. Uh, I don't know. It's it's scary. I don't know if Liquid will make it. Um, the technical NA team that'll make it will probably be Pain. But uh, Liquid has to play. Oh, here's the matches. Let's. I'll look at the matches. Complexity and Liquid play at 9.30. And Phase and Fours play at 9.30. And then Greyhound and Ninjas and Pajamas and Apex and Pain play. So I picked... G2, Fours, Nip, Phase, Monte, Liquid, OG, and Mouse to make it through. And my pick on the game, because you can do it for, like, fantasy shit. And um, Mouse is already out. G2 made it, so... Um, who can all make it still? All my picks can still make it, except Mouse. If Liquid wins, FaZe has to win. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, but they'll match up against each other when they're 2-2, though, so I don't know. But, yeah, the Major's going good so far, uh, besides the liquid shit. I don't know what it is. I think Elyse is... Uh, I think Elyse might be past his prime. Or not past his prime, but just done. Because this motherfucker is like playing like piss this tournament. Let me check the stats. Because it's not like... I don't want to just blame it on a leash, but like he's not playing good. Uh, Zorte is the top player right now, and <clears throat> how do you check? Here it is. Players. Highest rated team liquid player is for the tournament right now is Yakinder and he's got a 1.11 and so does Naf. OC's got a 111. Dude, is at a 1.04 rating. Where's Nitro? Oh my god, a 0.85? Jesus fuck. But, like, Elise shouldn't have a 1.4. He should be above, like, Yakader and them. He should be at, like, a 1.2. He should be up in the 1.3s, actually, with, like, fucking modesty and shit. Like, I don't know. Zorte and Monacy are the top. Rops has been having a good tournament, too. So, I'm excited to see FaZe play again and OG. OG just won their map pick, so... It is one one, and Monte just knocked Mongols out. So there's another team eliminated. So majors going pretty decently. I feel like um, a lot of the teams. There's not really been. Uh, sorry, there hasn't been really big upsets yet. Um, the biggest team eliminated would be Mouse for sure. Like they shouldn't have been out. I feel like, but my framing is so bad today. I'm just tired. But yeah, I know none of you probably care about Counter Strike, but it's what I've been caring about. Uh, I think I'm gonna try to go, not go pro, but like I want to play CS2 a lot because I think. I was talking to Seth, like, yesterday or whatever, and I think this is the best, like, uh, I've ever been at aiming in, like, CSGO. Because, like, he's been watching some stuff, and, like, I've been playing a lot, and not a lot, but, like, enough. And I feel like I've gotten better at aiming for sure. I always had the, like, uh, the map awareness and, like, the game style and shit, like, whatever. So, yeah, I think when CS2 comes out, I'm going to, like, try to, like, get on a team, maybe. I'm hoping, I told Seth, like, if he wants to make a team, I'll play on his team. I will i don't care. Like, I'll listen to him, you know. He can IGO, whatever, do whatever. So, yeah. Counter-Strike's cool. If you're interested in it, start watching the major uh, I think quarterfinals. No, actually, legends have to. You legends is next week, so it's gonna be going for a while. I'm gonna be talking about the major for like at least another week, so be ready. Um, so we'll switch to playoffs, NBA. Uh, who was first? Sixers, Celtics played in um. Joel and B played like the MVP, actually. Um, he was hitting a lot of jump shots. I didn't know how good Joel Embiid was at jump shooting and shit. Like he, uh, he's doing very well. James Harden didn't play hot, but like he's carried him two games throughout the series. And uh, Tobias Harris put up sixteen and eleven, which is pretty good. Um, I forget who else is in double digits. I think it was, what's his name, Quickly? Not Quickly, uh, Maxi, Tyrese Maxi. 
But yeah, they played good. And um, dude, Jason Tatum still is not playing good. I don't know what it is. Like honestly. He's been playing like garbage. Like, what the fuck was that? Like, legitimate garbage. Or not garbage, but like not to his standard. Because, like, I was talking to Brandon and I was like, yeah, he put up 25, but like he didn't put up a good 25 because he missed like the first eight shots and it's whatever. So, uh,. Jason Tatum needs to pick it up if Boston wants to come back. They're down 3-2 now. And I think the Sixers are probably going to win that series, honestly, now. At this point, they have the advantage. And they just beat the Celtics at home at the TD Garden, so for sure. And then uh, the Nuggets play the Suns at the, whatever, Ball Arena, I think it is, in Denver. And Jokic dropped a double-double. Or a triple double, actually. 29 something and something. And the Nuggets team is just so good, bro. Like I said, the uh, bench actually played good this game. Uh, they dropped like 36 compared to the Suns, 26. And the Suns put the bench in at the end of the game. So let's say like 18. So like the Nuggets bench doubled what. The Suns bench outputted, and uh, I don't think KD and Devin Booker play bad. They just they need to go off. Like they need Devin Booker to go off. It's it's sad to say that. Like it's weird that KD. I don't know if he's like regressing, but he's not what he used to be for sure. He's not like uh, shoot up any shot and make it. I mean, he he makes like about any random shot he takes, but I've been watching, and he's not been making, like, the just, like, fading leaners he usually makes. Like, they're they're playing good defense on him and shit. Uh, I forget who they had on him. I think they had Michael Porter Jr. on him, and Michael Porter Jr. is lanky and shit, so it's been going good. And uh, Jamal Murray is, like, a sleeper. I like Jamal Murray a lot. He's he's good to watch. Uh, I was talking to Michael about it. His layup package. I want that in 2K. The Jamal Murray layup package. He does, like, the fucking scoop arounds and shit. It's so cool. I wish I was athletic. I mean, I'm pretty athletic. I'm not pretty athletic. I'm not athletic. But, like, I could be more athletic if I wanted to be. But I don't try. Um, Today is... Lakers, Warriors, Lakers are up 3-1. There's no way LeBron blows a 3-1 lead. Like, I, there's not a possibility. Especially with how AD's been playing. And especially how the Warriors have been playing. It's not even the Warriors. It's just Steph Curry. So, Yeah. I don't know if the Lakers get a gentleman, though. They might get... The Warriors might get one back at home here and then pick it back to the Lakers and they win back at home. And then the Heat and the Knicks play, and I think the Knicks are done. Uh, Ethan sent me this tweet. It was like, I guess they just won it more than us. And I was like... Dude, like, the Cavs are buns because they played the Knicks beforehand, so... How does that, like, uh, portray the Cavs? Like, we must not have wanted it at all if the Knicks don't even want it. And Donovan Mitchell played, like, complete shit the whole playoffs. So, or, like, the five games we played in the playoffs. So, I was, that was, like, one thing I was worried about, about picking him up is uh, his playoff performance. Like, he's got like, one good series against Jamal Murray in the, like, the bubble, I think, but he still lost, and besides that, he just flames, I don't know, he's just not a producer in the playoffs, I feel like. It's weird, and I was worried about that, because we didn't get shit, I mean, out of it. I mean, we got playoffs, but, like, 
didn't make it past the first round. We'll play the fucking New York Knicks. We should have been to beat the Knicks. They suck. Um, yeah. Um, it's gonna be a short episode. I'm beat. I'm tired. I should have just went to bed and done this like at work tomorrow, but whatever. Um, I put Mother's Day. Mother's Day is Sunday, I'm pretty sure. So make sure you get your mother something if you like her. If you don't like your mom, fair enough. Some people got good reasons. Um, Eva, I'll get you some next week probably. You get paid next week. She'll say not to get her anything, but I'll get her something. Uh, yeah, I don't think anything else big is going on. Oh, my fucking ear. Ow. Um, I think I'm developing allergies besides that. <laughs> I don't know why I just thought of that, but my head kills me all day long, and I think my sinuses are fucked. I don't know if it's just, like, I develop allergies over the years or uh, the weather change and shit, but I don't know what it is. It's it's just annoying, though. And then it hurts my ears. I've had bad ears forever, so I don't know. I think the draining and stuff isn't going well. I think in the fucking head. <laughs> you know, my mom knows what I'm talking about. Uh, all right. I'm done. I gotta lay down. Thank you for watching the Wednesday episode. I might do... I'll make sure the Friday episode's longer. I'm gonna do... Uh, I wanna see if Seth wants to come on. I'm gonna message him, actually. Like, right now. And... Uh, I wanna see if he wants to come on and talk about the major with me. And we'll talk about basketball, too, because he likes basketball. And we'll talk about football, because he likes the Chargers. So... We'll see what he thinks about the Chargers. So, yeah. Or if I... Oh, I talked about maybe getting Derek, too. So, mm, we'll see. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But, yeah. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Um, don't forget Mother's Day Sunday. I'm going to say it again Friday, but... Yeah. Thanks for listening. Uh, sorry it's a short episode. I need to stop being a fucking... I don't know idiot and staying up all night doing dumb shit at night but it's fun fuck it i'm 26 i can do it you know might as well do it because when i'm 30 and married i ain't doing that wife would be pissed all right i'll talk to you guys later thanks for watching again love you guys later